Yup. Yeah. I ain't even tired. Clothes yet. Yeah. I still got the prison drip. I still just like biscuits. <laughs> here I still feel like biscuits and jelly. It's great Alabama shit what I see, man. I see Alabama shit. I don't see nothing else right now. What in the fuck going mm -hmm. on? Y'all the land of plain with this big red dyke built ass nigga. Sis ass nigga on more your ass. More your ass like booty house, boy. You know that, daughter. I'm back. So you converting over more. Boy, ain't none of that shit finna stop what's going on. Listen, this. Like you converting over more when I come home. Everybody try to get cool Rallo. They think Rallo finna save the industry. This what's going on. Man, listen, boy, God, boy, God, all niggas say. God, that's what these pie ass niggas do. It's just like that in prison. I like, I just man, love prison. On oh, my grandma, you leave prison. Nigga, go to prison, they be pies for scary as fuck. what they do, go Muslim. Yep. You see, they go straight Muslim. Go straight but not, Muslim. I'm gonna scream it up. You got some real gangsters that Muslim. Yeah. Like, they really so like that. that they real pressure. Like, really like that. How you gonna tell on a nigga then go Muslim? You just want to get everything God stand for. Me, got a nigga gone. DC The Voice, Alabama Prisoner Profiles. What's going on with y'all, man? Make sure y'all continue to like, subscribe, leave a comment about the content, share the content so we can keep y'all updated with what's going on in the Alabama Department of Corrections. Folks were asking, Big AC has seen the TikTok, right? Lack like SB's dad, he's seen the TikTok and he was digging what's going on. Maybe we can get bro to come on here. That would be wild. He hadn't seen the YouTube video. Also, Lord, I don't know how I'm in the rest of these folks keep up. <laughs> now I'm being bombarded with requests to look in the inmate deaths. And I'm doing my best with, to keep up with it. And to keep my hooks out there. To try to get people some information on the demise of their loved ones. You know what I'm saying? To see if this ish matches up with whatever harrowing story the alabama department of corrections has decided to give to these folks families you know what i'm saying so we're doing our best there right now y'all go check out that video i just dropped there executing mr casey mcwordy tonight at 6 p.m state of alabama will be serving this death warrant and a correction apparently he will be executed with the new method they approve of nitrogen hypoxia right as opposed to the lethal injection so correction there also inmates are saying the strike going on in easterland saw a quick little article popped out the department of corrections said Came out and said <laughs> there was no strike happening. And all I have to say about that is they also said there is no hostage situation at Donaldson. So do with that what you will, you know. Also, Depp over at Lockdown 23 and 1 picked up the Daniel Williams story. He's one of the, I guess, as far as I've seen now, the biggest YouTube content creator that's picked up the story. I remember when I first started watching prison content, 23 and 1 was, if not the first, probably the second. But I think I first started watching after prison show. And then I found a real prison channel, you know what I'm saying? Lockdown 23 and 1, you know, he just does reactions and stuff now. He's people run out of stuff to talk about or whatever. But yeah, y'all go check that out. I'm sure y'all heard it, bro. Now I'm bringing y'all this real quick. If y'all watch Cartoons Channel, y'all know the Alabama prison YouTuber, California native that did 23 years on a life sentence in the Alabama Department of Corrections. If y'all watch his channel, y'all know he is getting ready for a celebrity YouTuber sponsored boxing match with Mr. 600. And I hadn't really 
don't really know too much about Mr. 600, like what gang he's from in LA or anything like that. But apparently, he's some LA OG that they're gonna have a friendly boxing match with. And Toon just dropped this video on his channel last night. Um, this got some footage of him sparring in a gym here near Birmingham, you know what I'm saying? And so I hit him up and asked him if I could react to it, and he told me to go for it. So I'm just bringing y'all this real quick. Let's see what, uh, let's see what old Toon got going with the hand, you dig? Now, disclaimer, I don't know a hell of a lot about boxing, y'all don't rip me in the comments, but here we go. All right, Big Toon. Ooh, look at that flip. All right, Big Toon. Damn, dude, tall as hell. Uh, look at that reach on dude. He was not lying. Uh, okay with the defense. Uh, come on. Watch out. Uh, watch out. Ooh, Toon. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that look like there. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, Toon. Okay, what's up? What's up? Ooh. What's up? What's, what's, what's ooh. What's up? And he's got that reach on him, you know what I'm saying? So he's trying to have to kind of chase them around a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Trying to get to him, got to get inside like Mike T, like Tyson. Come on, uh. Come on, come on, uh, uh, uh oh, uh oh. Lock up, tire him up. All right, all right, all right. Break, break, break. Right, break, break. Dig. Let me get right. Come on. What's up? Ooh, ooh. Caught him. Come on, uh. Keep the head moving, too. Uh. Ooh, nice little miss. Nice little weave. Uh. Come on, baby. Come on, too tall. What's up? Ooh. Oh, ooh. Oh, ooh. Caught him. Uh, uh. Okay, lock up, lock up. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Lord, fix OG headgear. What are y'all? <laughs> fix OG headgear. Fix OG headgear. Okay. Okay. Keep your head moved. Okay. We're gonna do that. Get it, bro, right. But they said the gym's in Pelham. Pelham, Alabama. Get champions home. I'm gonna go try to stake that bitch out. Here's the raw footage. All right, here we go. Let's get back at it. 30 seconds. Go on, get your little breath. Get your little breath, too. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's get it. Come on, too tall. Step up. All right. Uh. Little body jabs. Uh. Uh. Ooh. Overhead. Ooh. Ooh. Lock up. Ooh. 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 Hit. Hit. Ooh. No, he almost threw bro out the ring. Yeah, too strong as hell, as y'all can see. Uh. Get OG headgear. Okay, let's get bro some more headgear. If y'all ain't finna do uh uh Ablon like that. Oh, what is that? They done gave him a. I guess that's some type of boxing. Oh, I could, you know, like he can see nothing out of there. Oh, caught him. Oh, caught him. Caught him. Okay. See what's going on. Oh, oh, body jab. Oh, caught him. Oh. Okay, big tune. Up. Oh, let's get bro head gear right. Oh, get bro head gear right. What's going on? Well, y'all seen it, Foundation. Y'all seen it. Um, Just a little quick snippet. Just a little quick snippet. I have some, I got some more footage. And there y'all have it, man. That was cool, too. Look like you got some, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be a good little fight. I think they said it's supposed to be sometime in December. I don't know if it's going to be on TV, YouTube, some streaming platform you got to pay for or what. But that's going to be coming up. This big cartoon right there by Trey Avalon, former Alabama prisoner. Obviously, y'all go check out Cartoon's channel. If you haven't yet, man did 23 years in Alabama prisons and he's got some, I'll be watching, I've seen everything cartoons put out. So yeah, me and bro gonna get the interview hopping going. He's at least been like 10, 15 miles or something like that for me in Birmingham, somewhere in Birmingham. So we gonna get that popping. It's just a matter of getting our schedules to match up. But y'all let me know what y'all think about tune skills in the comments. DC The Voice, Alabama Prisoner Bro Biles, i